Hey guys, Nicole here from Jesus Loves Everybody by Nicole Royal Ministries. Thank you so much for checking out my channel. In this video, I'm bringing you tip number two on how to help young children to stay away from drugs. Tip number one, the link is in the description box below. So when you finish with this video, you can check it out, okay? Thank you so much. Now, tip number two on how to help young children to stay away from drugs is... Show them pictures of those things that are considered drugs. We cannot assume that when we talk about drugs, the children already know what they are, okay? Parents, get on the internet, find those pictures and teach those children, okay? And show them the name, show them the pictures so that they are aware, so that they know what they are. You guys know already, knowledge is power, right? And I understand also there are some people who think, you know, ignorance is bliss, but if we are to find our identity in Christ, we cannot afford to be ignorant, okay? So we cannot allow our children to be ignorant about these things that can be harmful to them, okay? So let us teach them. Let us give them the knowledge and give them the power, okay? And um, parents, when you're getting um, those pictures on the internet, teach the children and also find out what's in your neighborhood, what's out there, what's in the street, what type of drugs are in your neighborhood, and of course the street names as well. For instance, we have cocaine. A street name for cocaine is candy or call it coke, and they have many different names for them. Okay, we have crack, hardball, we have heroin, we have big H, that's the street name for that, and we have marijuana, and that's Aunt Mary. You know, the enemy is a liar. The enemy will bring people in, in our children's life to trick them. Oh, let's go see Aunt Mary today. Let's go play hardball. And then the children, if they're not aware of these things, they, they, they're they innocent. They might think it's what it says, the name. You, are, you know what I mean? So let us give them that power, give them that knowledge, okay? And also we have, not we have, also, there are alcohol and there are cigarettes and there are also prescription pills from the doctors. These are also considered drugs because they alter the body's normal functioning, okay? So we will also want to, our children and us, of course, to stay away from these things as well, okay? So, and last but not least, we need to pray with our children, okay? Because really, it's God who can really help them help to keep them from temptations. And my prayer for all the children out there is that they are God-fearing, okay? Knowing that this body doesn't belong to us, but it belongs to God. Okay, lovelies? That's the information I had for you guys today. That's the message I had for you guys today. May God bless you. And uh, if you like this video, please leave a comment. Give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Thank you so very much. Until next time, Nicole here to help you discover identity in Christ for your children. Bye.